take this. Be, nah. go be gone. Nah. Holy water. Holy water counters regular water. Actually, I'll just pick up Lucina. Be a boring top tier main. Oh. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I use Lucina too. I hate it. I don't it, blame you. Like Dude, everyone hates it. I, I mean, everyone hates it. I mean, Nair spot dodge, jab, or F tilt, or side B is a 100% guaranteed combo. Yeah. Because spot dodge that. is broken. All right, so yes, we are seeing Diddy Kong, and we see Flash is actually using Dr. Mario. Hopefully in honor of Dr. Mario World releasing. The Doctor. <laughs> Shout out to Dead by Daylight. We're going to see if the prognosis, if this Diddy Kong needs to be put down the or not. The Doctor is in. Wait, is Dr. Watts here? No. Uh, yeah, that, 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 that. Dead by Daylight. It's a Dead by Daylight <laughs> oh. joke. I do. Dang. Gucci does not appreciate some humor. Yeah. But, okay, so Diddy, from what I have seen of Diddy, he's still pretty pretty much the same game plan-wise. Yep. Uh, you're, we get we do see a lot more up B mix-ups on stage, though. Yeah, because it's got that nice bounce off the ground, so it does keep you a little safer after you... Uh, oh, play. yeah. Is he too low? He's not too low. No. That recovery did get buffed. Oh, yeah. That got hella buffed. But... There we go. Now, Dr. Mario... Definitely and has a tool to deal with banana with that. I'm sorry, Gucci just pranked me super hard, and I don't even know how to feel right now. <laughs> okay, back to the match. We saw that banana to up smash though. That killed pretty early. Yeah, and that's one thing that Chomp's being careful about using because we saw that cape come into play there and just deflect the banana away. I like the up. I did like the up tilt punish on the uh, tornado on the Doctor Tornado. <laughs> the double trip. That banana's putting in extra work there. I would like to see more ledge trapping, though, because that is still one of Diddy's best strengths. Yeah, just sit back a little bit and just react to the option. Yep. But Flash is trying to show no mercy right now, and he's definitely got to be careful with the... Chomp's got to be careful with that tornado, because that thing is brutal. Wow, actually wow. hitting a jab in there. Oh, he almost caught that monkey flip recovery. Yep. But Chomp at least managing to catch that up beat. There we go. Catches him jumping off the ledge. The pill to actually cover his to cover his recovery and landing. I swear, the reverse hitboxes on up smash just confuse so many people because it sends you to the opposite side of Dr. Mario. Yeah, yeah, it's it definitely did spook some people. Uh, I believe he tried going wanting to cover a jump there, but I don't think uh, Flash had any reason to jump at that situation. Man. And I mean, Chomp is just having so much trouble finding this kill right now because yeah. he hasn't really been able to use the banana, trying these uppies, which are not working. No, so. Flash has definitely adapted to that very well. Oh, he catches the monkey flip again. Is that wow. it? What a catch. Good catch by the Flash. A solid three stock. Yeah, anytime you have a long lasting hitbox like that, that can just stay out there. It's so nice to have against kills Diddy Kong. as early as that did. Yeah, as granted he had like 170 percent for rage, but remember when Luigi could do that? I don't want to remember that. <laughs> I seen, don't. I've seen that move kill at 20. Dude, I hate that. Doctor Mario. Doctor Mario. Yeah. 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 It's absurd. I, Blender absurd. has told stories of what what moves he, how many oh. percents he's killed with that move. It's brutal. I'm scared. I'm glad he picked up Wario you know what again. You should be scared of these things. Oh no. Yeah, we got the Icy's coming out. All right, the Icy's. Now, it's definitely a character I know nothing about. The, the only info I know about this character is from uh, Unknown's Twitter videos. And based on that, this character can be extremely scary to fight. I don't, yeah, I definitely don't know how neutral would work for this character. Uh, apparently very nicely so far. Because he's definitely able to box him out better, it feels like. And on top of that, Having the two characters that can kind of mix things up by separating themselves. Yeah, extended hitboxes. Yep. Definitely to outlast, like, definitely outlast some of Dr. Mario's moves. Yep, and like that right there, just the up tilt desync to get that down tilt to follow up. Not gonna lie, that was nice though. Okay, catches the jump. Oh. Not getting an up smash though, because he was still frozen. Yep. Now it looks like Flash is definitely struggling here, but he's got them separated. Oh, not able to stop him though, so the Icy's do get to rejoin for a moment at least. Oh, he tries. He tries just giving him the first, but he yep. just just whiffs. 
Did, did he yes. just teleport? Yep, if they are close enough, they will teleport into that side beam. What? Yeah. That's weird. Yeah, kind of like with the Uppy as well, they'll also teleport. So that's definitely something that's going to be interesting to see how Flash is able to play around that. Obviously, he's doing just fine because he just yep. tornadoes. I mean, it's going to work eventually. It, it's only bad if it doesn't work. And it was working for him every chance he used it. Yep. Ooh. Imagine if that move was frame one invincible like Luigi. Yeah. So. Ugh. But yeah, like right there, you saw how having the one ice climber in the front to tank the pill worked in his favor there because the second one was able to complete the attack. Oh, yeah. Double side B punish. Tries catching them with up tilt, but just misses. Yeah. yeah. It's so weird that they teleport. <laughs> it just looks weird. Yeah, a little bit. Just, I know it's just a little, but it, I don't know. It just yeah. shakes me. I mean, a theoretically licensed physician battling two children that climb mountains for a living. There's nothing out about while that. Fighting, while fighting bears and various other wilderness. Exactly. That have the magical powers to shoot ice. Oh, almost clipped him with the uh, icicle shot there. Oh, oh does oh. that time, but the magnet hands coming in clutch. That was one of the few times you'll see magnet hands like really come in handy because they are definitely not as strong as they used to be. But even so, you'll see him come clutch at the at the best times. Catches the rollback with the down smash. Doesn't snipe him though. No. Nope. Oh, that was. Was that safe? That was scary. Yeah. Oh, the last hitbox just connecting there. I really love Flash's patience right now, though. Yep. Oh, Kid. there goes one. Nana. Yeah, I think that was Nana. Yep. Or no. Popo's the only one left. Got the Sopo. And that actually just beats out the uh, pill. Interesting. Yeah, it doesn't take much to destroy the pill. The challenge is just connecting past it. Or having a short enough end lag on your move. Oh, that forward smash. Almost getting him, but able to punish with dash tech. Able to get the stage control. They're going to send him out. I'll go out there and punish that thing. There you. we go. But is he too low? He's too yep. low. I mean, honestly, you're Wor so worth low. Worthy trade, yeah. Because yeah. he, he needed to get a... Uh, he needed to get Popo back, at, Nana back anyway, and at least guarantee that he takes the stock before he gets it back. Oh, he almost calls out that that landing. Yep, but the end leg on the air dodge still enough to let Chomp get another opening. I'm surprised Flash didn't actually go for. Uh, is that Popo or Nana? I keep getting it mixed up. Yeah, it's hard when they're using this skin because they're just so similar in color. But the pink gloves is Popo with. This okay, skin. Nana is the blue. Okay. Yep. Yeah, because usually Popo's the one that's blue, so this skin definitely mixes up a lot of people. Okay, good to know. Oh, is he? Okay, doesn't get that re doesn't lose the invincibility from the re-grab. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, he just misses. That would have done it too. Yep. At least forces him away from the ledger. Oh, nice use of the side B there to keep Nana safe. Yep. We've been seeing Flash on the ledge a lot, and he's got to be careful with that shield because it's almost gone. Yep. Nice call out of the jump there. Oh, just the fist going right through that those icicles. Oh, oh yeah. he had going to be enough smash. He punch. had the punish, but he w missed it. He was r turned the wrong direction. Yep. Uh oh. Not yet. The yep, good catch. Is. Good catch. All right. All right, clutch, clutching it out there. Yeah. Because he definitely would have died from a tornado. Yeah. He and was he was ready. And honestly, the ice climber seems to be a good switch for him because he can use that blizzard to kind of force Dr. Mario to second guess when he's coming in. The ice shot, you can set he, those off stage. He also has to second guess his out of shield options too. Yep. Because we saw he was trying to get the Dragon Punch a lot. Yeah. The tornado, though, seemed to be doing a pretty decent job of separating Nana and Popo from time. Especially to time. if he was able to catch Chomp at like too close of a distance, but near the end, he was Chomp was starting to distance himself a little bit better. Yeah. And we are going to Smashville. I I do see why Flash would go for the pick. Less runaway room. Yep. Uh, Having the platform that's covering almost the entire stage yes. as a get out of this combo or situation option definitely going to help. Please help me. <laughs> it's like the please help me platform. Yep. The one thing I could see working against him, though, in that regard, is for the side B, because if he's trying to approach Icy's, 
that platform is going to force him to jump up because if they're using the blizzard in order to zone him out, it's going to take longer for him to get in because he's got to get up on the platform and then drop down from it. So, And we actually are seeing a switch from Flash. Ooh. The Ganon. You want to get rid of Nana real quick, you go to Ganon. Have a sword that covers their entire hurt box. Yep. We're just going to poke through that shield as well. If you get a shield poke with Ganon, that's almost guaranteed Ice Climber gone. Lots of whiffs going on right now. Yep. Jab reset, but just misses. Grabs the wrong one there. Oh, yep. that hurt me. Every time Every time Ganon like, adds a hit to me. Did you see that hit stun? Yeah. Oh my gosh. There we go, knocks him away. Ganon Definitely is. doing a good job racking up the damage. Oh, he had the roll read, but he yep. just missed it. I'm surprised that didn't hit behind there. Yeah. Because that does have a hitbox slightly behind them. All right. Oh, good Rip. catch with the up B. Caught, a, so, caught the Sopo in that situation. Yep. Because he was still desync from Nana. Yeah, and that's one of the big challenges once you get to those higher knockbacks because Nana's knockback growth scales more than Popo. So... Nana will end up dying earlier, getting knocked further away, so you can have those kind of desyncs happen. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> he just punched him away. Yep. With the power of darkness. Yeah. Jeez. More side beat. More One side of them's going to work. It'll eventually work. But right now, if he doesn't get this kill soon, Flash is just going to kill him right now with forward smash. Yeah. And these Nairs actually beating out the side B, so the one reliable move for Chomp not working as much anymore. I know, it's a, Chomp's got to try and think of something else, like catching him, try, going, trying to go drop down. platform drop. Yeah. yeah. Not too far of a deficit, though, for Chomp. Yeah, easily come backable. Yeah, I mean, Ice Climbers can definitely get some good combo damage going. That was some good damage right there. Oh, oh no, oh. they're dead. That side B. That miss side B cost him his life right yeah. there, and now he's got a huge deficit. Yeah. I mean, just the fact that this near and honestly, a lot of Ganondorf's hitboxes are just beating out the side B. That's scary, man. Yeah, I mean, Ganondorf's scary as it is. Oh, he tried try catching uh, Popo again, but smartly going low was smartly going low there, Chomp did. And good catch. Oh boy, I'm scared for him. I'm scared for Chomp because he could die to anything right now. Yeah, it's like any whiff and I'm expecting a smash to come out. I'm just expecting the Dorias. Yep. Bumper's still not enough. That this is definitely a bold move there. Yeah, very bold. And he's pretty far out right now, but Ooh. the up be saving him. Oh, but that's going to do it. <laughs> Brutal. That cuts through him. I was just like, ugh. That was some brutality right there. Flash taking a 2-1, though, over, over Chomp.